I am very thankful to all my subscribers and I hope I will be getting your support like this in future as well. In this video, we will discuss the impact of Saturn Rahu conjunction in 7th house. There are different sections in this video, in these different sections we will discuss what is 7th house of birth chart, what is the meaning of this conjunction in birth chart, Rahu Saturn conjunction in past life, how will this conjunction affect health, married life, home and happiness and unexpected incidents in life with their positive or negative flavors and the best remedies. Before moving forward let's first understand what is the 7th house of the birth chart. The seventh house is also known as the horoscope's house of individuals' partners, one's business, and one's opposite in simple terms. It is the house of one's relationships as well not just marriage. It can be said that every house's opposite is what a person desires in that house so since it is the opposite of the ascendant this house shows what the person desires in a partner or the kind of partner a person will get. This is also the house of everyone else so it can be said that it is the house of your business just like the sixth house is the house of service the seventh becomes its addition and one's own business if a person will do business. The body parts denoted by this house are the kidneys, lower back and lower pelvic area. This house is very commonly known as the Bari Abhava in Sanskrit as it gives information about partnerships in one or many in general. Now let's discuss what is the Saturn-Rahu conjunction in astrology. The Saturn-Rahu conjunction in astrology refers to the alignment of the planet Saturn, representing discipline, responsibility, and limitations, with the lunar node Rahu, representing desires, illusions, and obsessions. This conjunction signifies a powerful and intense combination, often associated with karmic challenges and significant transformations. It can bring forth intense ambition, a drive for success, and a strong desire for material achievements. However, it can also lead to difficulties, delays, and obstacles in achieving one's goals. The Saturn-Rahu conjunction encourages individuals to confront their fears, learn important life lessons, and ultimately grow through the process of overcoming challenges. Now let's discuss Saturn-Rahu conjunction is in the seventh house of the birth chart general characteristics. Seventh house is the house of exaltation for Saturn since for any partnership marriage or business to succeed devotion, servitude and perseverance are required and Saturn stands for all of these qualities. The natural owner of this house is Venus which is friendly with Rahu so this horoscope has this tug of war of explosion and implosion happening in the seventh house of partnership, which impacts the person as well directly as this conjunction is directly aspecting the ascendant house. Now there will be few variations on a broad level and the usual results of this combination will increase or decrease accordingly. If this conjunction is in the house where Saturn is naturally exalted then the person will know how to handle the responsibilities of the partner. The partner here could be a little or a lot older than the individual owing to the presence of Saturn in the seventh house. This conjunction affects the ninth house of one's luck as well and the struggle increases for the person. Now if the ascendant is a friendly sign for Saturn and Rahu then this could be a little less harsh for the person, and the person would be very good at dealing with the masses of the lower classes. If this conjunction is aspecting the houses of Saturn itself then also this combination would be a little less harsh for the person directly but this energy will affect the spouse or partnership of the person a lot in a direct manner. One can also say very easily that these individuals will attract people in their lives who have this sort of energy in them. If the sign where this conjunction is positioned is an enemy sign then the person could get the maximum impact of this conjunction very harshly, this can be seen as lessening only if the ascendant and the moon are in good strength and good aspects. The impact will still be seen in the adverse dasha or sub-dasha of Saturn and Rahu. From this position, Saturn also gives its tenth aspect on the fourth house so this combined energy can give one a mother who was very strict and disciplined and a person could also feel that they are not understood completely by their mother. This conjunction could have very good or bad results when both these two planets are in the middle part of the zodiac sign and have their full power to give their results. This is because any planet is said to be in its total youthful stage when it is in the very middle part of any zodiac sign. This conjunction should be watched very carefully, especially if one undergoes the dasha, antardasha or pradyantardasha of shani in Rahu or Rahu in shani. Now let's discuss Saturn-Rahu conjunction is in the seventh house of birth chart and past life karmas. When the Saturn-Rahu conjunction occurs in the seventh house of a birth chart, it holds significance in terms of past life karmas and relationships. This combination suggests that the individual is likely to carry unresolved karmic patterns and lessons related to partnerships and interactions from previous lifetimes. 
The seventh house represents marriage, partnerships, and significant relationships. Saturn's presence denotes responsibility, commitment, and lessons learned through limitations, while Rahu represents desires, obsessions, and karmic influences. Together, they create a complex dynamic. This conjunction can manifest as challenges and tests in partnerships, including issues of trust, commitment, or power struggles. It may indicate delays or obstacles in finding harmonious and fulfilling relationships. The individual may attract karmic partners who reflect unfinished business from past lives, urging them to confront and resolve these unresolved lessons. Now let's discuss Saturn-Rahu conjunction is in the seventh house of birth chart and career. Because this conjunction gives some shrewdness to a person, here it is being formed in the seventh house which is the house of marriage, partnership, business and masses. The chances of a person using their strictness of Saturn and cunningness of Rahu on the affecting individuals can be seen in the work as well. They can be very good contractors who have to take the work from the blue-collared workers. These individuals can also make money through government contracts if the sun is positioned in a comfortable and providing position like the 10th house or the 11th house. The individuals could get into any profession depending on their zodiac sign and also on the 10th house and its lord's position in the horoscope as well. Now let's discuss Saturn-Rahu conjunction is in the 7th house of birth chart and marriage and married life. The individual would be totally secretive owing to the presence of Ketu in Ascendant and the focus of the person will be on the partner only. Because Saturn is positioned here which is teaching the person to learn servitude and perseverance initial affairs could be short-lived. Else, if the person gets into an early marriage due to various other circumstances like that of society or early marriages done by Venus or Jupiter then the early years could be troublesome until the partners learn the importance of the seriousness of the marriage institution. Ravu placed here can give many short-lived affairs and Saturn will not let them fructify until the seriousness is achieved and this will be fulfilled only in the right dasha, subdasha, and transit. This person again like the other houses impacted by this conjunction could have a surviving marriage if the seventh house or the seventh lord is in good dignity and aspect by the great benefactor Jupiter. Saturn present in the seventh house generally doesn't give separations also very quickly. So in case of a big quarrel, there could be distance but not necessarily a legal separation. Again, this would change as per the countries and their laws. Now let's discuss Saturn-Rahu conjunction is in the seventh house of birth chart and health. This combination could give the person some stomach and intestines and kidney-related diseases. These could include issues like kidney stones. Because the ascendant is also aspect by this conjunction so the person again could develop a taste for liquor and once again if other limiting factors are not present like Jupiter's aspect on the ascendant or the ascendant lord then the habitual drinking could also give the lungs related issues as Saturn is aspecting the fourth house as well. The person could also get issues with parts related to the ninth house as the third aspect of Saturn goes to the ninth house as well that his thighs and knees could get affected in the due time with age and transit and dasha or subdasha. This conjunction could make one suffer from the zodiac sign part signification related diseases as well during unfavorable dasha or subdasha. Now let's discuss Saturn Rahu conjunction is in the seventh house of birth chart and positive impact. A person is hardworking and very particular about the time schedule. A person could be very good at working with the lower classes or blue collar workers. If Saturn is good and leads this conjunction, person is law abiding and can get into government jobs as well. If Sun is also well placed or in a friendly sign one could get into a government job of significance and authority. A person could be a successful contractor getting work from the government. Now let's discuss Saturn-Rahu conjunction is in the 7th house of birth chart and negative impact. The individual could develop a very argumentative attitude with everyone and not have cordial relations with anyone. The ability to find the loopholes in business and partnerships and to use the loopholes to one's benefit could lead one to short-term partnerships or the individual could also go on the law-breaking path as well. Individuals might not get any better results despite having a very serving nature and love towards their partners as the partners could be very strict as well. Now let's discuss the best remedies for Saturn-Rahu conjunction in the seventh house. One dot person has to do more hard work than normal to please Saturn. 2. Such person should never hurt the feelings of his or her subordinates or workers. 3. Such person should donate dark blue color clothes to needy persons once in a year on Saturday. 
for such persons should never take gifts made of iron. So that was all about this conjunction, in our next video of this series we will discuss the impact of Saturn and Rahu conjunction in 8th house of birth chart. Till then, God bless you always and please like, share and subscribe our channel.